Good evening. Tonight, the spotlight falls on North London. We find ourselves at the home of Arsenal. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It's Arsenal facing Porter. Well, thanks, Derek. This should be a tight group, so it's vital these teams get off to a good start here. This should be a very competitive game tonight. starting 11. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Declan Rice in central midfield and the main forward is Gabriel Jesus Evanilson and on to Taremi good run very much in control of the situation well, but just too much height on it Declan Rice well Martin Odegaard is a really talented footballer and one who's difficult to keep quiet if you're oh trying. Derek big moment here and a goal it is no long wait for the opener today Well, first of all, where's the defending? They're all over the place, but give him some credit. That's a good finish. Great composure. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Gabriel Jesus. A oh, tremendous vision. Kai Havertz Gabriel Jesus a lovely attempt must be chance maybe and missing the chance to give them a bit of breathing space well that should have made it more comfortable shouldn't it but it's a wasted opportunity Declan Rice trying to open up the defence going for the chip and tipping it over the crossbar corner kick given to Arsenal and the short option preferred and delivered into the box well not the best clearance and the flag has gone up well he has to work a lot harder to stay onside there he didn't read the situation at all Arsenal being afforded too much room Ben White and now with Havertz Real chance. Surely, goalkeeping of the highest order. Well, he's got to be pleased with that save. It's absolutely magnificent. Failure to keep the ball by Arsenal. Plenty of support here. A oh, nice ball over the top. Opportunity. Well, no degree of difficulty for the goalkeeper. Martin Odegaard. 
Ben White. Gabriel Jesus. And a textbook interception. This could be dangerous. Oh, might be. Gabriel Jesus. And the keeper's technical skills there for all to see. Well, from that close in, that's a really good save. Such good reflexes. Well, the half-time interval fast approaching. It's Arsenal with the lead. And a good point, I think, Stuart, to get your critique of their performance so far. Well, they've worked hard and played well to be in front here, but they now need to keep their focus as we approach half-time. Unable to get himself back onside here. Well, he was always going to be offside. That was the wrong option. Good distribution. And very deftly cut out. He has teammates around him but really sticking to the task defensively. Keeping the ball has represented a challenge for Porto. Now he must favour the cross. Gabriel Jesus! And it's gone in for Arsenal. Will they be stopped from this position? Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. And there it is, the referee's whistle. The first half has come to an end here in North London. So the ball moving, the pendulum has already swung Arsenal's way in this game. Will we see more of the same in the second half? Rice? Might it be Gabriel Jesus? Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Evan Nilsson. And he has options available. Oh, that's a really good run. And quick thinking defensively. Not much time. Martin Odegaard. Now, well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? And yellow it is. A booking? Yeah, he was too impatient to win the ball and probably deserved a yellow card. Jesus. Gabriel Jesus! Really in the mood today. That was almost another one. Well, he looks so sharp, doesn't he? Just not the finish he was hoping for there. Trying to craft something and putting his body on the line. Well, quite simply, not precise enough from that position. Varela. Ben White. A chance to whip it in. Gabriel Jesus. Well, hit with ferocity when accuracy was required. Pepe. 
Eva Nilsson. He fancies it. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Trying to deliver it accurately. And it still could be dangerous. Electing to shoot. The save was a good one. And dealt with it nicely. He read the situation defensively and did his job. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Well, a disappointing end to that break. Paremi. Well, it's attractive football, but they need effective football. They need a goal. A goal! As they cut into their advantage. Still plenty of life in this match. Well, he wasn't going to waste this chance. 1v1 against the keeper, and he slots it away with great confidence. That's a good finish. Martinelli. Ten minutes left for play. Declan Rice. And promising stuff from Arsenal. And let's give credit to the defending. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. Steven Eustachio. Martinelli. And there it is. A penalty given and a chance perhaps for them to finish this off. Well, he's not happy, is he? He just needs to calm himself down here. And a chance maybe to settle this. In it goes! A well-taken penalty! Well, here we can see it again, and he's done well to read the intentions, but just can't get a touch on it as it sails over him. So close to being a fantastic stop. and 3-1 the scoreline at the moment Galeno good technique display and totaling up all the stoppages we'll have two additional minutes Saka so full time it is and a morale boosting three points on the board to begin their European campaign yeah, it's so vital to get off to a quick start in these group stages. They'll be happy with the three points, but now they have to back it up in the next game. Six points and you're halfway there. And it was an eye-catching performance, you've got to say, from Gabriel Jesus. What did you make of what you saw from him? Well, I thought his all-round game was excellent. It was his ability to find space that impressed me most. And with a bit more luck, 